morning. Today is a very exciting day. That was straight up weird. <laughs> he would, would he be out this late? No. Because I was so serious. Oh, it's so cute. It's Ryan's homecoming. Hey everybody and happy Friday morning. It is Jill and welcome to the vlog. Um, today I'm by myself right now actually. I just ran a bunch, a bunch of errands and I don't know if you guys are the same way that I am but first of all I'm at a red light so if the red light changes I've got to skedaddle but I save up all my errands and I do them all at once instead of like doing little mini ones here and there and getting out every day and doing something. Um, I keep a list and I put them all together and I go. So today I'll try to remember everything I did. I went to the Home Depot because I needed to get a few things to for the um, fireplace surround and the mantle that I'm making. Then I went to Home Goods, which is a home decor store. Uh oh, then I went to Trader Joe's, then I went to the post office, then I went to the Goodwill and donated. All right, I gotta go. The light is green. All right, I'm back now. I am at the gas station. See so you're pumping gas right there. So anyway, so I finished my errands, which is very exciting. Today is a very exciting day because it's Ryan's homecoming, which is going to be very fun for him. Um, he, as you know, is a freshman in high school. So this is his first opportunity to go to homecoming. And since school's canceled and it's virtual, of course, homecoming is canceled. So each one of the grades has um, put together sort of their this grassroots homecoming um, dance. Of course, they don't have the football game. And if you guys don't know what homecoming is, for those of you I've seen some comments, those of you who definitely aren't from the United States, um, homecoming is a time when a high school or a college celebrates um, the the graduating, like people who have already graduated, they come back and they go to a football game and they go to the dance and that kind of thing. So that's why it's called homecoming. So it's basically like an, an alumni weekend. And um, so for the high school, what they normally do is they'll have a football game on Friday night, like a home football game, and they celebrate the alumni. And there's lots of um, activity and the marching band and all that kind of thing. And then the next morning, on Saturday morning, we normally have a homecoming parade, which different sports and different um, uh like activity groups or club groups uh, put together floats in the parade and they parade by the high school and then on Saturday night it's usually the homecoming dance which everybody gets dressed up as you've seen before and um, and then go to a dance at the, at the school so all of that has been canceled so like I said they're the, each of the classes are putting together their own grassroots homecoming and tonight is Ryan's so we're very excited about that and um, I think he's at home getting ready I'm not sure it's it's not gonna happen till tonight but I think he's getting all of his stuff ready so I'm looking forward to hurrying home so I can um, see what's going on yeah. okay. all right so uh, what's the thing this might not be it oh well that's that's all I have do you need new ones <laughs> oh my gosh Katie's got a job this weekend and she needs to wear khaki pants and she's not happy with my khaki I pants I told them I wasn't wearing khaki pants are you are you laughing at me oh my gosh no, these are great. oh no, my they're low waisted but they're also cropped so yeah like, and they're khaki so what are you gonna wear? Do you have shorts? Uh, well, I think me and Molly might have to go in a like old they gave navy us skirts. run. I think that's a good idea. Oh, but cute! They gave us skirts and these Helen Hansen jackets. Wait, you need? They're giving you them? No, we give oh. them back. We get to wear them. Oh, that's nice. Right? Like Katie and, and Molly are working the boat show. We gotta be there at five thirty. So. All right, so Ryan's getting all ready. He's gonna borrow some things from Caden. Caden, thank you. Yeah. Yeah. We got suspenders and two bow ties. Did you yes, see this? Because two bow ties. The one might not. Uh, Which one are you gonna wear? I don't know. I both of them are tough. They are both oh, tough. Yeah. We'll see that. Yeah. Yeah. Are those flowers. They are. I like those. Right. Oh. And yeah. we have a corsage. Oh. Yep. Okay. You have it's corsage? beautiful. Yeah. You want to see it? Wait. I'm sorry. <laughs> Can somebody find this thing on? <laughs> 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 Would you like to explain? We're all laughing, but I still don't know. <laughs> Isn't that beautiful? It's like a What's in the fridge? Maybe that's me. Because I, I was, no, was so serious. <laughs> All I've had today is <laughs> cheese and marinara sauce. And you're dressing up? And pizza. Wait, so you're going to be the only guy there? Yeah. Because there's pasta. Isn't that fun? Yeah. Party. They're going downtown for dinner. So many Thank goodness you got your hair cut yesterday. Uh, so I, does that look nice, Mom? The reason I didn't want to get my hair cut yesterday was because of this. Okay. I wanted long hair for this. Kaden, yeah or nay on Ryan's haircut? Yeah. 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 Yeah
Yay. 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 Much better than before. Yes. I don't you think? Yeah. Uh, I, don't I, don't think I don't think it's better than before. I think they're both good. Well, I, I think, think it's, it's better than before. It's good. I think it's definitely better than I don't before. Think it's better, but... Okay. Well, you're going to look very handsome now. If you had that big, long hair wearing that outfit, you, well, not the one you're wearing now, but that outfit. That's true. You would kind of look like a, like a bum. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I kind of agree. Yeah. Okay, but I'm going to go have the show. All right. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you, kid. Yeah. Anyways. <laughs> this is one of their outfits. Well, just the top, right? Yeah, just the top. And you're going to get pants to wear with that? That's really nice. You look very nautical, Ma. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. I look nautical. Katie, you do? I love that. Is that a sweater? Oh, it's so cute. They're Why gonna, are we looking at someone's, someone's gonna make a fun edit of us. Let's look. Let's look. Oh, oh, oh. look happy. <laughs> <laughs> Let me go this way. It's my sweater. Oh, we got it 60 years. <laughs> <laughs> oh my I gosh. Whoa, Katie, that was dangerously close. That was dangerous. Oh my gosh. Dangerous, Katie. <laughs> all right, is that all you got, or do you have more? We have more. You have more? Okay, let's look at more. I like to move it, move it. Kind of baggy, Loki. Oh, oh, those are your skirts. Yeah. Oh, why is there, is it pleated in the back? Is it what? They're pleated in the back? I don't know what that means. They're scrunched. Scrunched in the back? Yeah. Oh, they've got like elastic back there. Yeah. We fold them so we don't look like pilgrims. Because if you wear them all the way straight, <laughs> they're like. <laughs> so we don't look like pilgrims. Okay, yeah, mm, yeah. That's what I yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see, Ma. <laughs> <laughs> oh look like, 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 like creepy doll twins. <laughs> Them up. I see, and then they got a little too. bit, yeah, and they got a little squinchy in the back. Do you have to wear those skirts? No, there's one of the things. We can either wear pants or these. It depends on the weather, I guess. Okay, I got so it. There's no yeah, shorts in this. Yeah, there are no shorts in this. Oh, oh yeah, no, you don't. Oh geez, yeah, you don't want that. So this is their is uniform. This is like climbing boats, right? Climbing and cleaning boats yeah. and stuff. Climbing down into them and then back up. Yes. Yeah. We'll yeah, you don't want that. Well. <laughs> Anyways. Why did you walk? Okay. Anyways. So it's these girls are the working show. next weekend at the boat show where they're going to be hosting, hostessing and pe uh, people come on to new boats and look at the boats. So they're going to be the face they see. So can you see Waldo? There's two. I have them down. Yes, I do. You do look like Anyways, a um, oh, I like them though. Maybe you guys should never not wear that together at the same time. All right. Apparently, there's a pro tip that Mike has shared with Ryan. It's a little hot take he's got for his uh, couple things. Girls, I know a lot about what girls look like. <laughs> what they don't like? Yes. And one of the things that I found that girls do not like are dirty fingernails. Oh yeah, that's true. And. Um, yes, so you, so you know you're a girl. Uh, yeah, I do, and you're and my especially husband. Especially when you're dating someone, you don't want somebody to show up with dirty fingers now. So one of the things that I found that happened to me was I wanted to have nice polished shoes, so I would polish my shoes. Oh, and no! And I would get black uh, shoe, shoe polish, polish my nails, and I couldn't get it out. And oh. I was, no matter how hard I get in stain, so I'd be, I didn't have polished shoes. But then it would look like I had, I had <laughs> dirty fingernails, finger, which is really bad. Did that ever happen when we were dating, or was that some other girl? Um, Maybe you learned before you started dating me. Right, exactly. So here's my pro tip: take a uh, oh, this, and do this. That, my friend, is a good and idea. This. You guys, comment down below if you polish your shoes. I I wonder if that's like a um, you gotta have very polished shoes if you want to be. Out and about on the town with Ryan Ardo, <laughs> man. He's got a date. So I'm helping him out. I'm doing a solid, and uh, hopefully he'll remember this one. Yes. So, uh, so um, kind of below if you. Um, you polish shoes. Yeah. Or if you like guys with dirty fingernails. So. <laughs> exactly. <laughs>
Ryan and I are on our way. I'm dropping him off over at his friend's house. But I am probably, if I film there, it's just going to be a little bit of B-roll. I don't want to embarrass him. Yeah, so, right. yeah, but we'll, we'll be taking pictures. You look very handsome. Thank you. Chilling on the couch. Hold on. Nate smash right in there. I hope it's not Nate. Do you think it's Nate? In the kitchen. He would, would he be out this late? No, it's when knock on the window and it's at a high. Okay, so you guys, like, it's 12. Now it's 12 23. It was about 12 15. It's a high. It's so crazy. And they were sitting over there. The lights are off in here because we don't want people to see us inside the house. So, what? Is it him? No. No. All right, so can you guys see my finger? Okay, so hold on one second. So the kids were sitting right over here. Let me turn this on low. Hold on so you can see what's going on. Okay. All right, so everybody was sitting right along here. Wait, what? I think that's just what Nate. I hope it was Nate. And that window right there is actually off the ground. Was it Nate? Was it Nate? Wait. I hope so. Anyway, they're sitting there and all of a sudden somebody knocked on the window. And said hi. And said hi. His which was so deep. wicked freaky. So we immediately turned off all the lights. Because you guys know to do that. You turn off the lights inside. So nobody can see you. So Ryan is texting his friend Nathan. Why would he be out at 1215? Does he live close to you? He does. He lives right up the street. Yeah. Hold on. Why? And, and he wouldn't climb a bush. I know. <laughs> yeah, I know. Nate would probably be loud though. Yeah. yeah he Nate, definitely. Nate yeah. is not like. Would he be by himself? Why is he writing you back? Not yours anymore. Anymore. What? <laughs> Wait, but what? He was just snapped. Wait, no, he's inside. What? He just snapped out of me. So he's confused. inside. He could have walked up the hill in that time. Inside his house? But this was three. Oh, you said ago. where are you? Not yours anymore. Maybe he means not your house anymore. Call him. Can you yeah, call him? Yeah, exactly. That's what I thought. All right, this Might is a little be, I thought um, Miss Jill was asleep. <laughs> oh, it was him? Yeah. Oh, thank goodness. What? Oh, that was very I freaky. Need to call me right now. <laughs> Tell him that you scared the bejeebers out of us. <laughs> All right, we're to Was it just him by himself? I guess. Nate. What the heck just happened? Did you knock on the window? Oh, hold on. I'm putting you on speaker. <laughs> Nathan. Someone just knocked on her window and then said hi. Was it you? Maybe. Oh, thank oh goodness. Oh, my God. You scared the bejeebers <laughs> out of us. Was it just you? Yeah, it was just me. Oh, my. Wait, <laughs> yo, wait come back down. Wait, can you? Yeah, you can go back down. Yo, bet, yeah, yeah. Yo, sorry. Do your parents know you're back out? Back like, back Roman? Back. You're in bed? I didn't know if your mom didn't want me there, so I left. You goofball. That's, I of course would have let you in. Wait, you just scared wait, us. Why would you come to the window? Just knock <laughs> just on the door. Just come to the door. Well, I thought the window would be more sneaky. <laughs> <laughs> Truth. You that was straight up weird. You were on the couch right by there, and we hear, no, I got the window, and you said hi, and everyone started freaking <laughs> out. Yeah, we like, turned Nathan. the lights off. Uh, I think like Leonardo yeah. DiCaprio on the Leonardo DiCaprio? He dies. He does. That's who he looks like. like Ryan, Ryan, Ryan looks like, let me say. Ryan, don't look straight at us. Like young, like on the Titanic young? Yeah, or a little bit younger. Like, um, no, no, look kind of uh, more to the left. Oh, wait, that was good. Wait, look back. <laughs> a little like side eye. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. wow. Yeah. Yeah. Leonardo DiCaprio. Oh, oh, trying to make it bigger. Yeah. <laughs> yes, that's perfect. Yeah. Oh, my Same. gosh. Same. Right. Oh, you know that um, you know that uh, famous picture of Leonardo DiCaprio with the mm. cigarette in his mouth. Yeah, and his like hands are probably like that's kind of what he looks like. Oh yeah, except minus the cigarette. The one with the drink is in class. Oh <laughs> yes, 
Or <laughs> Ryan laughs so much that you can't no, understand no. what he's saying. I don't know. I don't know what he's saying, but they're having a long joke. All right, you guys, we are ending this night. It is actually the next day already. It's one o'clock in the morning. I'm exhausted. Can you go? Oh, we had a huge packed day today. It was a wonderful day. What made me happy today was... Uh, definitely Ryan having such a good time at his FOCO, fake homecoming. Awesome. And looking so handsome. And um, making my mantle, which I did not put up on the wall yet. That's why you guys didn't see that part, but we'll do that tomorrow morning. And Morgan and Priscilla returning. Ladies, what made you happy today, Morgan? What made me happy was when I was in the car with my with Priscilla and I was on the phone with my mom. And then she was like, I'm just so glad you're home. Oh. And I was like, I'm glad I'm home too. And she was referring to here as home for me. That was, she and I was like, yes, mom, I'm going home. So. Cause you can't make it home to your yeah, mama. So, so we're, we're, your, home. we're your yeah. home. Mm -hmm. What made you happy today, Priscilla? Um, the weather was amazing <sighs> for a 12 mile hike. And then when they released us, we got in Warren's car, we sat there for a second and the sun was kind of setting a little bit and we're like, we can leave. Oh. We can finally go. And we're probably more worried because it was a pretty long week. Nice. It was, yeah, so you, they had a tough, tough, tough week. That's a, that's a really that's nice. It's a good feeling, yeah? Really Katie, what made you happy today? Um, I don't know. Morgan and Priscilla coming. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Ryan, what made you happy today? <laughs> Hey, you guys, and just so you know, Brennan's in bed already, so we kind of, we didn't film him because when we came home, he was leaving, and then when he came home, we were leaving anyway, and he made it, he went to bed while we were out dropping people off, so you'll get to see him tomorrow, <laughs> but he came home, and that's also what made me happy today, is Brennan coming home. All right, Ryan, what made you happy today? Uh, having fun at the FOCO, and, um... That's pretty much it. All right, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Thank we you. hope you enjoyed our vlog today. Comment below what made you guys happy today. We cannot wait to see. Be sure to hit subscribe and that little bell button so you get all the notifications every time we post a new video. So have a great day, and we will see you tomorrow. Bye. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.